Hey guys, this is MB from UndrogChance.com and welcome back to my baseball betting model projections. Uh, yesterday I went 3-1 plus 4 point uh, something units and right now I'm sitting at 24.50 units of profit to the season, which is uh, pretty good. Uh, and I will be quick today because uh, this weekend I am uh, taking off uh, from betting. I will make projections, I will make analyses, but... Uh, all the emails and all the questions and everything else will come on Monday because uh, I will spend some extra time with my friends, with my family and so on. Okay, So let's go quickly to the games. Uh, I will show you today's bets. Uh, I have Texas first five inning at one unit. Uh, those are the odds. I have Kansas City Royals. I have San Francisco Giants, both money line, uh, full game and first five innings. I also have Arizona and I also have St. Louis. So those are one, two, three, four, five, six bets. Let's quickly check uh, the projections. San Diego Padres against Yankees. Based on my projections, um, maybe small value with Yankees, but not good enough for me to take a bet. Uh, Chicago White Sox, they don't have a uh, qualified pitcher for my betting model. I already mentioned this in my, in my pre previous videos. Toronto, Minnesota. Based on my projections, Minnesota should be a little bit bigger favorite, so maybe small value with Minnesota, but uh, not good enough. This number tells me that there is not enough value. Texas, Baltimore, so there is no value in full game, uh, but there I, I found a value with uh, Texas first five innings. Uh, and I like Texas team this season. Also, Baltimore is playing well. Uh, Houston, Oakland, no value uh, because... Uh, uh, I simply don't have uh, a pitcher qualified here. The same with Tampa Bay Rays. Uh, Tyler Glasnow, I think, will play, but he's still not qualified. Uh, Philadelphia, Atlanta, Wheeler, Morton, based on my projections, Atlanta should be at minus 152, bookmakers minus 133. So small value with or lean, if you like, with Atlanta, but not good enough. Then we have Washington against Kansas City Royals. Uh, I have Kansas City at minus 133. 36 bookmakers minus 108 and because of that Kansas City Royals is one unit bet as I already mentioned uh, Pittsburgh Seattle I stay away from this game as you see my numbers and bookmakers numbers are basically the same so those are my numbers those are bookmakers numbers San Francisco Giants yesterday I had San Francisco Giants they beat Milwaukee but it was not good bet despite they won I don't know 12-3 uh, or something like that uh, they scored 12 runs in first five first three innings but the bet was still not good, okay? Because uh, after I took the bet, the the odds went up, so the bet was not good, okay? But today I all I found a value with San Francisco Giants again. I have them as a small favorite. Bookmakers have them as a small underdog, uh, and I also found the value with San Francisco Giants first five Phoenix. So first one is 1.5, 1.25 units. The second one is one one unit only, okay? Boston, Arizona. Uh, I found value with Arizona. I have them as a small favorite. Bookmakers have them as a small underdog. Uh, and then we have Cincinnati Chicago Cubs, not qualified pitcher. St. Louis Cleveland, uh, yesterday I had St. Louis. They lost against Cleveland, so I hope they will bounce back. Uh, today uh, I have them at minus 135. Bookmakers have them at plus 101, and this is clear value. So St. Louis uh, at plus 101. Uh, uh, playing 1.5 unit, okay? And then we have two less games, uh, not enough value. You can see my winning percentages, my odds, and that's it, okay? So uh, that's it for me today. Uh, as I said, I will uh, not work a lot this weekend on betting. Uh, so all the emails, if you have any questions, uh, they, they will be responded on Monday. We have a lot of evenings, events, parties here. Uh, Finally, we have a sun, so I will uh, spend the rest of the day outside. So thank you for watching and I wish you good luck.